Ready? All right, friends, one more stop at the zoo today. My favorite animal lives down here at the zoo. Now, he does not come from Rochester. This animal would not be native to anywhere where we live. He comes from Africa, and if you look way in the back, you can see a really tall roof with two words under it, giraffe feeding. Think in your head, why is that roof so high? I bet you can figure that out. So giraffes are one of my favorite animals. Every giraffe has a different pattern on his coat, kind of like our fingerprints are all different. A giraffe's coat is all different too. When a giraffe is born, he is able to stand up and start walking that very first day, usually within a couple hours. And I think one of the neatest things I learned about a giraffe was how long their tongue is. Think in your head why a giraffe might need a really, really long tongue. Also think in your head, why do you think a giraffe's neck is so long? Is there something that makes it, is that long neck something that makes it hard to do things with? Or does it make it easier to do things with? So here's your task for today. See if someone can help you. Go onto your computer and look up giraffes. See if you can find five facts. Remember, a fact is something that's true. Five facts about a giraffe. See if you can find out where they live. See if you can find out what kind of food they like to eat. See if you can find out something about whether they live in herds or by themselves. Look up their predators, and maybe you can find one fun fact about their neck or about their tongue. All right, friends, I can't wait to see your story, and don't forget, you need to have a picture with it, and then you can send it to us. Bye-bye.